Hey everybody, it's Jared here, and welcome back to more Feed the Beast. Um, I mean, damn it, not 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 freaking Feed the Beast. Uh, I mean to say, um, and of course, I, I'm already forgetting the name of the bloody game. Sorry about that. I probably should not be jumping around because that is going to cost me dearly in the hunger department. Um, I'm gonna actually eat one of these soon. I I should really have not been running around. You know what? I've got like a million cucumbers. I'm gonna eat like a couple of those. Okay, I'm gonna have. I'm gonna carry. I'm gonna eat four of these. Okay. I, I refuse to waste my I refuse to waste my beautiful produce. So I went on a bit of a mining mission. I got like a crap ton of iron. I found some redstone, um, and I'll show you guys where I found it. It's like in in the ravine. So uh, if we go here, right? So if we go to like edit edit this, right? Uh, I believe yes. Yeah, so these are the coordinates y twenty one, and um, I found something. Um, I found something else special, which I think you guys are gonna like. I found something. They they are called gold orberry bushes, but they only and they hurt if you touch them. I believe they. I looked them up, and apparently you you can you need to place them in like a pitch dark room. And I and I had to like actually close th this whole room up before I could place them. Uh, did I actually take away the ceiling bit? I want them to be able to grow as high as possible. Also, I got an I got an inver pickaxe. Uh, it's not the best pickaxe, but it's not bad either. I'm gonna close this up again. Um. It, it says it's mining level is like uh, it says it's mining level is redstone fortunately I think yeah, I think like the iron pickaxe is pretty much the exact same Unfortunately, this does less damage, but I wanted to play with a little bit of Tinker's construct So I built all these things off camera Um, and I'm just gonna grab a couple more cucumbers. Um, I'll just yeah I'll just take four more for now I, I want to use like as little of that as possible and like and because I'm using like yeah zu Zucchinis in these and, and absolutely no cucumbers. I have like a good reason to actually eat these right or maybe I should, like, make, eat corn. I could make popcorn, right? Ooh, I should try baking potatoes. You know what? I have way too, I have way too many potatoes anyway. We are going to try and bake some potatoes today. That is, that, that is something I want to do, so. I guess we'll just divide these up for a start. We'll split some coal, uh, between these two. And we'll cook some. See how, and see how nourishing, nourishing they are at the end. Uh, they probably won't be very much. It'll probably only be just, like, the stock. I carry the stock around for em emergency cases only. I pretty much when I've just run out of food, and I don't- I do not allow myself to eat it. So, um, I- I did finish off this Tinker's Furnace. It looks different from last episode. Uh, I got some more grout. I made this. Well, actually, I made another one of- Actually, I made two of these. I did all this off-camera. Um, I also moved these things around here, and I'm- I'm gonna jump up. I'll- I'll show you guys. I also made a- I made a stone longsword pretty- uh, it was pretty inexpensive to make. Um, so if, oh my god, that is really filled up. So if you guys can see these, uh, well, you should be able to see the sear drain. Well, for, oh, it's too high up, but, um, I noticed that, like, the sear drain seemed to only have, like, one input, but, and, well, actually, no. Well, uh, of course you would have normally, w w I, of course you would, oh god, there's something in my neck. Sorry for all that stuttering. Um, and I noticed, holy crap, I noticed that it only had one output. Good god. <coughs> Pardon me. What the hell is in my throat? I feel like I always get like choked up whenever I go to like talk a, a lot after eating something. Good bloody heavens. I do not like this one bit. But now we have like way more stuff than I really need. I should probably take some of this, but I don't really want to. So, um, I believe, uh, so pretty much each, like, for example, like berry, if I were to harvest from the bushes there inside of there, I guess you could say once they develop, right? Um, is worth about uh, one nugget. So pretty much each each berry set again will be worth one nugget. Uh, these concentrated essence berries it says it tastes like creeper, but you, apparently you can right click these and get these for like experience. Uh, I looked, I found that out when I was looking up uh, or berry bushes, which I think is pretty dank. So nourishing sack. Okay, I'll, I'll just eat these nonstop then. I have way too many potatoes anyway. I mean it's perfectly fine. I I really don't have anything to gain from like eating potatoes, right? Screw you, potato. <laughs> All right, or maybe I should like like try bread out sometime. Can I eat raw wheat? Of course I can. Man, I got way too much wheat, but thank goodness the wheat actually stacks. I don't like how all the other stuff in Pam's Harvest Craft doesn't like to stack up. I wonder if like, whoa, oh my god, look look at all the iron that we have. Almost like ten thousand millibuckets. And then how much bronze do we have? Um, yeah, <laughs> more more than seventy five hundred. So I guess uh, I wanted to show you guys this. I also made this sort of like station thing here. I think kind of looks nice. Uh, all the um, I want to say gold, but this is actually aluminium brass. And all the aluminium brass ones goes in there, go in there, and the wooden ones go in here. And there's a reason there are no ingot wooden ones, and that's because there isn't a pattern for that. And even if there was, I don't need that. Um, 
so let's. Oh, pardon me. I I think I burped there a little bit. Uh, so let's see. I wanna I wanna pull out all of the silver. Oh yeah, I remember. I thought it was like, what the heck am I gonna do? I I totally forgot. But now I remember. We can actually finish off this thing. So I said I was gonna make a furnace, right? Then we need to work on the power source. Um, furnace. That is how you spell furnace for sure. Oh wait, crap! I don't have enough gold. But we do have the redstone that we need. So this, and then two more for the coil, right? So um, I just need to wait around a little while um for this thing to produce enough gold. So I guess it would be check now because it should be growing technically, right? So we just pop in here. Oh, for God's sake! Of course, because I typed R and it just resets all this. I'm no, I think I'm just gonna like reset the controls. Right, so it doesn't do this again. It pisses me off so much that it does this. It's so, it's like, it's almost OCD that it, okay. You know what, I, I guess we're just going to go into controls. Um, where are our controls? <laughs> I forget where everything, ah, yes, controls. Uh, let's see, it's R that does it, right? We're going to change that to, I think it's supposed to be like rotate. Inventory sorting. You are going to left bracket. All right. I, I am certainly not going to press that key, and what the heck? And R doesn't do anything now, which is a very nice thing. What the heck? Oh, yeah, so R actually pulls up the recipes. And now it doesn't reset my inventory anymore. Yay, and I'm never going to press left bracket. Although I may do that for, um, perhaps and giggles, right? These things still are not growing. Oh, also, if you, if you guys had noticed before, uh, the crouch effect is sort of, like, animated. Oh, we don't have legs in this game. I'm only just after realizing that. It, like, crouched down, it sort of, like, hovers a little bit. I wish they would actually, like, add legs. and It's just, like, at this point, it's just, like, a hovering camera, which is a little odd. I mean, at least you have your arms, but it's like, where the heck are my legs? And for some reason, it's a switch to baked potato. Um, and also, I haven't been able to find any gold underground quite yet. Um, so how about we mess around with a little bit of Tinker's Construct? I mean, we don't have, like, all the best materials yet. Uh, wait, yeah, silver. Wait, what? We have, we, we really have that much silver? Well, I'm just gonna pull a little bit of it out then. And reduce that just a small bit. Um, now, what can we make in the meantime? So, I already made this Invar pickaxe. It's not my favorite. Um, probably because it doesn't have, like, all the things it maybe should. Aluminium brass. We can make a lead pickaxe, but I have, I have a feeling that won't be as good. Invar. The problem is, I don't know what mines what. And that that's, like, a gigantic problem. Um, you know, we can always try to make steel for now, right? That's not going to screw me up this time. Yay. Wait, no. no that's still not steel. Alright, so I believe how you make, um, steel. Oh, crap, you need machines for that. And I still need to find gold. I mean, of course I have, like, a source of gold back here, but that, that means I'm going to need even more gold. How exactly can you get gold again? So I guess we can look that up, right? Gold. How in the world do you get gold? Well, I suppose you can get it through, like, ore berries, right? Um, na native gold cluster. Thomcraft. What the heck? Um... Oh, it gives you two? What? Pulverized gold. Let's see. Um, pulverizer. How do you make a pulverizer? Which, I, of course, I'm going to need more gold for. Wait. Oh, 10% chance? Oh, that's why I was doing that before. Pulverizer. How do you make a pulverizer? You need more gold. That's fantastic. Well, it looks like we're not going to be making that today, unfortunately. Um, that was the initial plan. I thought the bushes would grow a little... Maybe I should have been like... A little more patient and like waited around a little longer. Oh, actually, I want to break the silver block up first. Oh, uh, do we have more silver ingots? Yes, we do. So I'll reorder that. I have like a thing for the order. I probably shouldn't. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Maybe I should just like try reordering these completely. So if two goes here, four, nine, twelve, twenty-three, thirty-one, then nine would go here. Carry all these down again. Uh, thirteen goes right behind there. Uh, I uh, sorry guys. This, I know this is a little boring. Um, I I just need to find. You know, what? maybe we'll just cut to when this is done okay it might take like a couple of minecraft days for like this to cycle around which i don't really like but i i'm just thinking you know what? i guess yeah so i guess we'll just cut back i'm gonna do a little bit of mining back in the ravine and i'll see you guys in a bit finally freaking gold that took way too long to do for just okay well what exactly can i throw out um oh my god i did not ask for the andesite cobblestone no thank you but we got one I'm gonna do a little bit of searching around. That took way too long to do. I am, like, pretty much lost in these caves. I don't know where I am at this point. It's like I went across this, like, l lava bit here, and I'm so fortunate to have found this. So I'm gonna do a little bit of digging, see if I can find even more. I don't think there is, though, or else it would be touching. Yeah, it would normally be part of the vein. I'm gonna collect a little more of this, because I already have, like, a slot of redstone in my inventory, and I don't, like, want to waste that. If I could have, like, thrown something else out to get that. 
All right, so I guess we're just gonna teleport back now because I do not intend to waste my time like climbing. And and because we have the system, we're gonna take advantage of it. Please don't like tell me I can't use it because I am going to use it even more if you tell me not to. <laughs> um, and we and I guess and I guess we're just gonna bust this out for now, right? So and then we'll pour that out. And how about we just check in and see if, if any progress has been made. And actually, I'm going to eat this baked potato on this thing here, right? Let's see. Ooh, this thing has been growing. So, it'll take a little while, but um, soon it, we should have a good amount of gold. And the thing is, the bush should keep expanding as well, right? So, eventually, we'll have, like, a lot more gold, hopefully. So, for now, we have one... Oh, are you freaking kidding me? Oh no, not Electrum! Electrum isn't what I wanted. What the hell mixed with it? I should have just smelted that down normally. I'm an idiot. The problem is, I don't know what makes Electrum. Well, I guess we're just gonna pour some of it out because I wanna see what we can get from this. And in the meantime, we're gonna smell even more stuff down. Um, because why the hell not? I'm not gonna make the same mistake twice, by the way. It, it's not gonna happen. Me screwing that up is not gonna happen again. Oh, so we're full here? Literally no more things can fit in. All right, then we're gonna pour all this Electrum out. This actually looks pretty cool. I li I really like the look of Electrum, you know? But I didn't want it to combine with the gold. I actually need the damn gold. Well, I guess I'll just wait a little while, f while for the plants because I do not want to do that all over again. No, thank you. Well, I, I will go down into the mine if I have to. But I I'd rather just stay up here. I really don't want to have to go mine again. You know what? I don't think that was very fair. So, you know what we're going to do? I'm going to do something that I think is justified. Um, oh my god, I wish I wouldn't get in the way. Items. I'm going to just, like, pulse. Okay. I guess we're just going to go into creative mode, right? Because I don't think that's very fair. I didn't even know that wor it worked like that, okay? So, we're just going to pretend that didn't happen. And we're going to grab one gold and good. Alright. I'm, I'm letting you guys see this. Because this is the way I play. Alright. There we go. That, that's fair. Now, now we can make this. See, that was pretty much the thing I was going for the whole time, right? Because I want to be able to make this. Um, oh yeah, put the- I'll just try smelting on the petroleum. It'll explode. Um, can I put the cinnabar in here? No, I can't. Okay. That's actually probably a good thing that I can't do that. The problem is, I don't know how to get the cinnabar out. I mean, how am I supposed to use this? Oh, I should- I think I need- I think, like, you know how there's such thing as, like, a uh, cinnabar dust? I think you need to, like, do that, right? All right, and and I don't feel guilty that I did like that gold thing either. So I guess that's a good thing because if if I feel like bad that that I cheated it, I know I've I know I've done the wrong thing. But but if I feel fine that I've like cheated in, it's like okay, it's fine. I don't feel any self guilt about it. But yes, a redstone furnace. But the next problem, um, it needs power, I think. But we got our first electrical device, so that's great. But it has no freaking power, and I can't remember if there's a wrench. In, uh, in thermal expansion. Let's see. Um, wrench, custom NPCs. How many freaking wrenches are there? Uh, thermal expansion. Yes, you do need it, but that's not hard, that hard to make. So let's see. We need a piece of tin. All right, one piece of tin. We're, we're running a little low on tin, which is a little, um, which is a little bit bad. Fortunately, this wrench isn't too expensive. To, oh, wait. <laughs> Noob, it goes like that. Crescent hammer. So we can just shift and right-click that, and we can pick it up. I didn't actually know you needed to shift right-click it, but it looks like this wrench is something I'm gonna be, um, yeah, something I'm gonna be carrying around from now on, or maybe not. Good God, look at how much lava we're using! Oh crap! No way, that is full. How about we go to the top? I do not believe that that is full. Holy crap, it is. So, well, then why does it say it's full? That's stupid. Well, then I guess it's time to take some things out, isn't it? I think so. Let's empty out a lot of this bronze. This bronze should not be in here. You know, I'm just gonna remove, like, all the things in here, right? If you guys would, like, excuse me for, like, five years while I take all of these out. I'm gonna bust out these, uh, ing ingot casts as well. Um, because this could take a little while to do. So, I'll see you guys on the other side. This could take, like, 70 years, and it still says that it's full. Which is really ridiculous. Alright, so guys, I've done what feels like a freaking century of, like... I'm um, pulling out like ingots, right? And it's taken forever to do. I'm working on like iron back here And it's just like an amazing amount of material fits into like this thing here, and it's molten and 
I'm thinking, like, if this is actually a real-life thing that you can do, if you can really store that much iron into a place this small, and I'm doing this, like, make sure nothing turns into electrum this time, right? Because I do not want to waste my gold, and I'm going to be more careful next time because... Oh, wait, actually, um... Yeah, I, I do need gold for this, I think. So this is from what mod again? Uh... Thermal expansion. So we, so first off, I'm gonna make a steam dynamo. But oh, we need silver, not gold. Okay, I've wasted a little bit of time. Well, you know what? Uh, I guess that's perfectly fine, because I'm gonna, I'm gonna work on taking a little more of this out, right? Because um, I don't know. I just don't feel like having it in here. I don't think it serves any purpose being in here. Um, so I'm just gonna take it out. And if we need it in there, I will simply just. Uh, smelt it down again in ingot form because it will take a lot less longer th that way. Alright, so I'm almost done taking all of this out. We're just gonna grab this last piece. Um, yeah, and we'll get rid of wait. I, I want to like dissolve the last few bits of this. So this should pretty much all be ingots nine left. Oh, I did that perfectly. Yeah, okay. So then we'll do like, um, I'm actually gonna wait for that to be finished raining because I want to make sure all of it gets in here then the last like what? Uh, one nugget I can completely destroy by doing that, right? And then I can do this. I can pop this up here, pull this down, and I can just throw this back in here. So, and it's all happy and dandy. Nice. And is there a block left? Yes, there is. I have way too much iron. But then again, some people consider that, like, no iron at all, which I guess is sort of understandable because some people get insane amounts of iron. I, uh, I guess the better would be obscene amounts of iron. So we'll take three redstone here, and what else do we need to make this? We need a lot of copper. Well, I guess we have plenty of copper anyways, right? Um, I'm just going to grab the whole stack here. Um, then we need four times two, that's eight. And then how much more? So let's see, eight for a start, and then two iron. But we are going to need more than that. Um, then one silver, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then two iron, right? Assuming that I counted that right, hey, now we have exactly one and a half stacks. Alright, so now let's pop into our crafting table here. Let's try and make this. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, I did do it right, alright. So that's the main bits done, then we'll do this. And then I think we can make our steam dynamo now, right? Actually, that's in the wrong way. Uh, assuming that I'm doing this right. If not, I'll have to, yeah, I'll, I'll, I need to flip these two. And yes, there's our steam dynamo. Uh, I believe we need a, um, I believe we need a lever for that, so let, let's quickly make one here. Boom and boom. There's your lever so we can power this. And we'll place this like over a water source, right? Wait, I do I actually need to put water into this? That's a pain in the ass. It's so, oh my god. I, I would seriously hate to have to do that, you know? All right, so for now, um, let's see. Uh, I guess we'll just put it by our bed. Actually, do we have any so, some sort of like cabling? Can I make cable? Is that is that possible in this game? Well, you know what? For now, I'll just place like the furnace right next to this thing, right? Uh, please don't tell me I need to put water in here. That would annoy me so much. Oh, crap. That's incredible. Well, at least it's right next to it, right? So it's incredibly easy to do. Well, I guess that's all the water it will take for now. Um, so then I'm guessing... Okay, so for now I'll place this next to it. Because right now I only want to power this, right? Um, then if we turn this on... I, I actually really like the animation for this thing, too. Oh, come on, place the bloody lever. Actually, I think I need to break that. Sorry, sugarcane, but I don't really need that much anyways. We'll throw that in there. Um, what sort of block can I place? Well, actually, if we have a nice block, I'll place it. Well, you know what? We've got, like, um... I want to make, like, a block out of this, but I have a feeling I'm going to need it later. Okay, well, we'll just use sand for now, because it goes with the rest of the thing, right? Then we'll power this on. Is this on? I think it's on. It should be receiving a signal anyways. Alright, so now we'll throw some... Actually, I want to turn this off to try and get it to, like, start when I actually really want it to. Sorry, I, I'm all totally disoriented. I've all, I've been recording for, like, an hour, and I recorded for, like, uh, 25 minutes before I started this video. So I've been going for a really long time. Um, let's see. Okay, well, how about we try one petroleum and hope it works? I, if, if it actually works... It does work with petroleum! Holy cow! Oh, no. If I really have to deal with steam, that's going to be annoying. Please tell me I don't have to deal with frickin' steam. Oh, no. Is it just going to, like, build up with steam? Is that going to be the case? So, 
I think I'm fine. It doesn't matter if it has, like, a lot of steam, right? Or does it mean I can collect steam? Wait, hold on. How do you even get steam anyways? Is it going back down into water? If that's the case, that's pretty nice. But steam seems to be going down. You know, well, it, it, it is called a steam dynamo after all. Too bad it doesn't, like, extract water directly. So for now, this is enough energy. Why isn't it sending? Okay. Um... Let's see. Uh, redstone control status signal required ignored. Uh, high. So let's see. So if I were to do this, no, low. Like that. Like that. Well, I'm just gonna do ignore if not, because I actually want this thing to run. Wait, it's not running. Oh, the steam has to go down. You know. Oh. Hold on. I'm gonna throw another petroleum in there. Hold on. I'm gonna throw another two petroleum. Actually, that did a lot the first time. I'm going to take that out. I, I'm so glad petroleum actually works. It has, like, a burn time of, like, 2,400, though, right? Which is pretty amazing. I mean, like, a lava bucket would go for way longer, but that works pretty well. So, 9 RF a tick. Max power output. Where can power go out, though? Oh, God. Augmentation. Um, I can use this wrench to write. All right, let, let's see. Crescent hammer. Yes, so that's how you get it to gain power. All right. I wish that there would, like, be an actual animation for this. I think, like, I think for, like, a certain mod, you can get an animation for it, but this this one just doesn't have it. But, yay, we got power. This is very stupid the way we have power, but, yes, we finally have it. And we have a very, very nice furnace, in my opinion. I think in the future we will get some cables. Let's see. Do we have, uh, wire? And this is from mod. Ew. Um, let's see. Do we have any cable? Cable. Some nice cabling from Minecraft Reloaded. I mean, Mine Factory Reloaded. Jesus. Um, I think there's some pretty dank cables, though. Pretty dank. Oh, the ME cables. Maybe we'll use those in the future. The problem is, I have no idea how, like, the ME system works. As if you guys remember, I've just been using, like, uh, the other system's uh, form of storage, right? Good, this thing is still going up. But then we gotta wait for the steam to drain. So I think this is plenty enough power for now. Um, then I'll just, like, refill this, like, once once both of these have drained, because this is a little much power for me right now. But I'm pretty satisfied with the amount of power we've got, but I don't think I actually think we need this if, if we have this thing run on its own, right? So, I guess, Sugarcane, you can go back. I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't mean to kill you. Um, yeah, I guess I'll just put the lever in here. Maybe we'll need it in the future. Well, as you guys can see here, 20,000. And petroleum is still... It, it's, like, takes about... Well, I don't want to see exactly 10, because that's that extra 400. That makes it, like, 22,400 if it's 10 of these. So that that goes a little over this. Um, I guess you could say, like, about, like may maybe 9 of these. About 9 of these equal 1 of these. So if I were to put that in there, that, that would generate a crap ton of, like, power. That would be amazing. But I don't really need that much power right now. As you can see, it's completely full. I don't even know what we're going to use this thing for. Maybe we'll use it, actually... Ooh, maybe I can make a pulverizer next, but the problem is I don't know how to, like, transmit power in this game yet. There we go. There it turns off, and you're going to drain the steam, right? Awesome. I don't... Maybe we can collect this steam. I don't know how it works. Can we get burnt by steam? Can we get, like, steam burn? <laughs> that would actually be a really bad thing. But for now, I guess I just, like, rotate this thing, right? I'm going to try and get this thing to water these plants over here. I... Let's see. What plant on the edge do I want it to water? Uh, I'm actually probably going to make another watering can, though. Um, I kind of want to get more corn. That's something I really kind of want. Really, really, really kind of want. But I want more zucchini. All right. So let's see. Okay, I can place it like that. Let's see. Right click. Right click. Do not left click. Not sneaking. Um, let's do this. Is it going to work? Right click. Aim level. Low. Level low. Are you going to right click with this thing? How about you left click? Oh, crap. It needs power. Oh, that's stupid. Well, uh, I'll, I'm gonna go make myself another dy dynamo. I'll be back in a sec. Hold on. Petrol! It's gonna start working. It's not working. Um, mechanical hands are not delicate enough. Oh, no! Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, crap. Oh, that sucks. But at least we got ourselves an autonomous activator. Oh, God. I'm gonna toggle that off. I thought I was gonna start choking up there again. That would've been really bad. But, um, I remember, like, before, it actually showed you, like, the percentage on, on, like, uh, turning it into, um, I believe it's beef jerky. No, it's monster jerky. Yay, but a lot more, and this one finished as well, so maybe this does work. If, if, if that's the case, that's pretty broken. 
Because that's just like in literally infinite gold. That that is literally um, hey, gold doesn't grow on trees, but it does now. Sorry for my disgusting humor. All right, well I'm gonna go out now. See you later, wonderful orberry plants. Remember to make more uh, off. Uh, I guess more orberry offspring. All right, thanks. What the heck is that noise? That sounds like a horror game noise. It reminded me of Outlast there for a second. And good God. And I'm, I'm by the way, I'm, th I'm thinking we may start playing a little more Outlast uh, soon because I loved Outlast. And I still do love it. It's a very, very good game, uh, in my opinion. So I guess we'll let this smell down. And and then I'll pull up this um, pulverizer. Sorry, I'm a little slow at typing that. Um, and then I guess we'll make this. Oh, I actually need flint for that. I know I had flint at some stage. Do I still have it? Of course I didn't. I threw it away because I didn't need it. I like the current time. So, of course, the best thing to do is throw it away. I think I needed flint at some stage or something. Oh, I can't remember. Can you actually make flint that other way? Let's see. Um, I know there was a way before you put, like, three together. Oh, you can't? Really? Okay. Of course, you, you, you can use pulverizer to make that. So, um, I was thinking of doing some sort of, like, uh, automated cobblestone mining system. And then, uh, if you guys have ever heard of, like, Sky Factory, and you guys, if you guys know of, like, uh, the automated process... Uh, to sort of get like, um, and if you guys know the automated process to go pretty much get like infinite materials, um, if you guys know what I mean by that, I'm thinking maybe we can do that, the same process for via Sky Factory, because it seems like we have a lot of the same stuff that we can take advantage of, right? I mean, we have like, um, we have like thermal expansion, the ME system, which I have yet to figure out how to use. I think it's a little bit complicated. I mean, I don't think it's incredibly complicated, I just think it's a little bit complex, but yeah, okay, so I think we're gonna end this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, this was kind of exciting. I really enjoy doing this part here, and we're just going to pull this out for next video. I hopefully won't do anything in between videos. M maybe I'll make up some sort of plan for next video. And holy crap, I've been recording for an hour and almost a half. I've been recording for an hour and, like, what, uh, 24 minutes. Hour and 24 minutes. That that's really long. It's going to take forever to render this. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, maybe if, if the video seems, like, like, a little disoriented and in a strange order... Uh, I'm only saying that because I feel like I commentated for like more than half the time, but I'm hoping that's not the case or else I'm going to have to cut out a lot of stuff and the video may, may seem in a bit of a disorder. And, and what I mean by that is pretty much like the sequence of like pretty much if I'm telling a story or something, which I don't think I did. Or if I'm talking about something and then like just jumps to a certain part, it'll call, it, might, it may cause a little bit of confusion, which I do not intend to happen. But, yeah, my rambling has continued on, and that's the reason I, I, I have to cut out a lot of my rambling sometimes. But if it's something, like, I actually need to show you guys, I can't really cut it out. But, again, enough discussing all that. I hope you guys enjoyed this part. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.